hello. This is uh, Veracity Trigger. I am Paul with my uh, friend Frank here, and this is the battle that uh, Leoness is attacking the castle of Carnival. I always thought it was kind of boon. It Maybe it's kind of. Well, I don't know. The B O N E could have a bone sound. Yeah, I, it could it's be kind of bone. Kind of, it could be kind of bone. But kind of bone sounds silly, doesn't it? In a way, I, I don't know. I guess I want to say kind of boon. But yeah. if I said kind of boon, it would be two O's and an N, right? Yeah. But I. I like Daniel I guess, Boone? Yeah, we could just say kind of bone because it is B O N E. So I, I guess and kind of bond would have a little hyphenated over the O and then end there wouldn't be an E afterwards. No. So oh, I this is a very, very sad day. He's gonna lose his Fenrir. Yeah, it is sad. I well, hate seeing the dogs die more than any other creature. No, I do like I, I do like dogs. I, mean, I do like the scorpions. I mean, I do have that save a scorpion fund that you guys are donating to still. I hope so. so. I mean that needs to that needs to live on all the way to the end. That one will be all the way to the end, and then everybody will get to see the Death Needle at like level, hopefully level thirty. Wouldn't that be amazing? That would be very nice. I just got to kill some really high leaders with that thing. Yeah, we'll get it. That Tiamat man, that Tiamat ain't going anywhere. You are that not gonna kill that thing. Not for a while, at least. Now, you are not going to kill that thing. Well, not for a while. That's why this uh, first attack is mostly to uh, kill off all the other monsters. So he uh, runs away. Well, they're going to run away with the Tiamat again. Well, I'm not going to kill either way. Because first of all, it's got, it's, got, it's got Protect on now. I can't beat that. Just kill Unless off all you the... can Divine Raid a few times. Well, the thing is, it's not... Like, he can move forward, I think, four spaces versus the three the other Hydras can go. So he could get to that Phoenix. You got there? Or if you kill the ghoul, he'll be right in front of Patternut's face. Yeah, but I'm, I mean, these guys are going to die. Although I think Patternus is definitely weaker to the team. I don't, I don't think he's going to overpower the team. That was a nice fire claw. <laughs> yeah, that is. I don't think they'll stay. I mean, I just, I don't see it. You kill off like two or three other monsters. They got a couple of powerful things, but I think they're just going to save them and oh, oh. split. Yeah. Save them and split. Hey, that's a good way to say it. Yeah, not bad. I'll just say that from now on if I just want to retreat. Of save course. them and split. Yeah, absolutely. Works out. Yeah. You like chicken meat? <laughs> that's or chicken or lion meat? What should that? What should a griffin actually be? Should it be? Uh, a gigantic um, eagle or a lion? I mean, it's supposed to be half and half, but what would DNA wise it be more so? I think more of an eagle because of the wings, though, and the claws, maybe? I don't know. Because the head is the eagle, the brain is of the eagle? Possibly. Huh. That's interesting. Never actually thought about that until now. I think a lot of people would think it would be more of a lion with eagle components, but you might be right because the brain of an eagle, I mean, if it's all bird brain, you know, it's like a gigantic front of a bird, and it just has the bottom half of a lion, well, then the bottom half of, of the lion isn't as strong no. as the eagle part, because if it's as, if an eagle was as big as a lion, that, that beak, yeah, that would tear into things so easily, you know? Yeah, that would be so powerful because they probably, they probably would grapple onto their food with their with their claw and their legs, and then they would pound on it like a woodpecker with their with their beak. So their beak would be the the killing part. Yeah, it would. This is kind of what I imagine it to be. Oh, I don't know if you should have done that. It's it's, it's a new one. Don't worry. He'll, He'll live. Be a dead one pretty soon if if they stay. <laughs> I'm not going to say if it is. Mm. Hope I don't kill him. Oh. Good. Squeeze me. Now watch this. <laughs> Did this to get the angel up a little higher. A little higher? 
Oh, there's one. Oh, another one. There's one. And there's two. There's two. And two kills. And I'm hitting a lot of the other guys on top yeah, of it. Yeah, they're gonna run. So? Oh. I almost think you'll never get to fight that Hydra. I think I'm gonna fight that Hydra somehow. If anything? <laughs> or the Tiamat. I think I'm gonna have to fight that Tiamat. How high do you get? Two more. Okay. Not high enough. Well, he's getting there. Take out there. I do like dogs, but I kind of want to leave these guys a little lower. Excuses, uh, excuses. Lower. You yeah. hate dogs. No, I, I, I that's, he said You just I, killed a dog. How could you like him if you just killed one? This is just a game. That's I would blasphemy. never kill a dog on a real life. Bl blasphemy against who? The dog. I think. How can you have blast me against a dog? Dude, you're going to have three phoenixes with the queen's team here. I know. Isn't that so, Special. so cool? Well, I don't know. I don't know if you have enough points. Yes, I do. I already know. I checked it out. He does. You have three phoenixes for your team? Yes, I do. Woohoo! He'll live now. Yes, I yes, he will. It's alive! <laughs> It's a miracle! I'll heal you, Unicorn. Okay, Mr. Unicorn, I'll, I'll heal, heal you back! <laughs> no, let's just leave. <laughs> Ghidorah's like, stop all that healy stuff. It's making me sick! <laughs> <laughs> well, he's a, he's a black element, so... Yeah, so he probably is. <laughs> yeah, it was, it was gonna make him vomit. <laughs> he was gonna vomit in his mouth. <laughs> I, he, I can see that. Here, let's get through this. I'll talk to you. And uh, get to the map and show you what's going on with the map. So you can see what we're doing today. I, I got back. I got that guy. About time you guys came back. You were gone for three months. What yeah. took you so long? Well, what if you found a cave? Yeah, sometimes I do. Well, good for you. <laughs> so here's where we're at with the map. And it looks kind of strange. Yeah. Here are the rankings now since Triss is gone. And so I'm up two castles at the moment. And my buddy here you passed is the ten closing in. And But you have passed the 10,000 mark of yeah. points. And Escars is just really, really going down. Mm -hmm. So... Going down the tubes. Escaris is probably going to be next because I want to show you Prince uh, Prince Lance. No longer is a prince, but King Lance. He will be king soon. And I can get Geno Thunder and go to town with Geno Thunder. As soon as Zemeckis is gone, Lance will become king. So, all right. So pretty much the next plan of attack here is um, uh, I'm going to be attacking from Camel Fort. And any one of those castles around it is a viable target. Let's see what Paul's... Probable next Mostly, attack. I'm attacking my uh, my defense team from Aston is going to go here to defend Salisbury. Well, I attack Tora, and then I may may come down unless Frank wants to take out this one. In that case, I will go north instead. But for right now, I will be taking out Tora next, and hopefully defending Salisbury. All right. So take it easy, everybody, and we will talk to you later.